I was watching the report of the week uh, and how he deals with rude comments, people who are thoughtless and just outright mean. And his responses to these people giving him cruel comments. Here someone's calling him an albino rat. And uh, he uh, reacts with humor and good grace. So I thought I would try my hand at this here on my channel. Uh, this is my channel for concerts that I have uploaded and a few other miscellaneous things. But uh, let's take a look here at the most recent one from four months ago. This is ZZ Top at the King Center. Uh, Now, to my knowledge, this is the only complete ZZ Top concert from their current tour. And uh, as I started the concert, uh, I was wedged in between two full-size adult males in the cheap seats up here, as you can see. And uh, so I'm sitting on a tiny little chair that's probably a foot wide. And I'm wedged in elbow to elbow with these two huge men. And... I thought, well, I'll try to record this show. Now, watch what happens here when the recording starts here. First, I'm zooming. The band is about to start into Got Me Under Pressure. I'm zooming. Now, watch here closely. Watch what happens. See how the camera jiggled around there? At maximum zoom... What you're seeing there is me simply tapping my finger on top of the camera, causing it to shake crazily all over the place. This is not a $2,000 Apple iPhone. It's a nine-year-old Sony Cybershock camera. So it has motion stabilization, but only to a certain point. Uh, so what I quickly realized during this recording was that it would be best if I simply settled on a single zoom. So after this first song, I settled on a specific zoom here and um, would just tilt the camera back and forth between the different members. Remember, the slightest touch of the camera sends the image jostling because I'm at maximum physical zoom here. And this camera has this wonderful feature. This is not a digital zoom. This is a real physical zoom where the camera lens has extended out to its maximum resolution. So you can see details such as Billy Gilt Gibbons' uh, guitar work. You can see the fake beard and fake wig of Elwood as he is filling the role of the late Dusty Hill. So uh, this is what I settled on and for the rest of the concert, despite having tired hands holding up this camera and one battery swap near the end I managed to successfully record the entire concert. Now what is the purpose of this recording? The purpose of this recording was solely for my personal edification. It was not for profit. I don't plan to ever sell this for a single penny. Uh, the only reason I shared this recording on YouTube was to uh, enhance the visibility of ZZ Top without Dusty Hill and to show that they can still rock and that you should go and buy a ticket from them. Let's go take a look at their current tour. Here's Ticket Network and uh, they're showing they're currently touring through Canada. So if you wish to experience the re true sound of ZZ Top you're going to have to see them and hear them live. My recording is only a pale shadow, a faded reflection of what reality was. And maybe you can get better sound on a brand new iPhone, like I said, but I record with the equipment I have, which was a Sony CyberShot camera recording in video mode. So let's take a look at uh, one of the comments here. Love to see the evolution of Elwood. Fantastic. With the utmost respect, who the H recorded this? I appreciate the sharing, but damn, next time try a tripod. I got motion sickness the first minutes. For this person in question, you might think that 
a venue for live concerts would welcome you bringing a tripod, uh, but you'd be wrong. I would have been thrown out of the arena or the tripod would have been confiscated. Uh, so clearly this is someone who has no knowledge of audience recordings, no knowledge of apparently even attending a live con uh, concert. But I just wanted to upload this and uh, just let you know that for those that do appreciate these uploads, you have my thanks from the bottom of my heart. And as far as those of you complaining about a gift horse in the mouth, look up that phrase, gift horse in the mouth, and you may be edified on learning some manners that your parents apparently completely failed to teach you about etiquette, politeness, and gratitude. You, if you want to make a better ZZ Top concert, knock yourself out. Here's the shows they have right now. Uh, next month, you can go and do a better recording than I did, and I would be fully happy if you shamed me and made a better recording. So, I could have just blocked this guy's post, but he speaks for a lot of rude, insensitive, foul-mannered people on YouTube. And next time you're ungrateful about getting something for free, why don't you just zip it and keep it to yourself? Um, I don't know what else to tell you. Thank you.